our next little task is going to be to create some internal links. So uh, the page that we're going to add them to, you can access from any of the pages that you go to after you pick a service. So if we go into service descriptions, we can access any of those pages. Then where it says all services, we are going to be adding the internal links to this list and they are going to take us to the different areas on the page. So I'm going to close out of here. So our first step is to add attributes to um, the locations that we are going to link to. So we are going to open under view and service, we are opening the all page and we need to add IDs to all of our H1s. So I'm going to copy some of this. So inside the H1, I'm going to do ID equals full for the full day treatment. And then for the half day treatment, I'm going to change it to ID equals half. And for the two hour treatment, I'm gonna change it to ID equals two. For the one hour, it's gonna be ID equals one. And then down here for salon packages, ID equals other. So at this point, I have my target set. Then what I need to do up top is I'm going to use the ASP fragment uh, tag helper to generate the href for me, but I still need to key in my anchor. So I'm going to do my opening anchor, ASP fragment equals and I'm going to give it the name full, which is what I called the ID. And then I am the queen of copy paste here. So I'm basically going to paste the opening and adjust it. There was a reason I picked really short IDs. And then I'm going to copy my little closing anchor. And now I've got my internal links. So let me save. And we're going to run this. Oops, let's see, I want to start, that'll work. Hmm. Well, let me try this again. There, I knew it wasn't broken. Uh, so go to service and go to any of them and click on all, takes you into this page. And then if you click, it should scroll you down to the section. So that does seem to be working.